And welcome back guys, um, Kano here again from the Marine Discovery Centre. I hope your day is going well. Um, another part of what the Marine Discovery Centre does here, as well as teaching people about marine creatures and also environmental sustainability and things that you and I can do on our daily basis to help our environment and our sea creatures survive, um, is teaching those kind of understandings but from an old perspective. Um, as, as old as I guess some people might say humanity goes, that being we kind of integrate cultural um, education within uh, all these things as well. So what I do here in this particular part of the centre is teach people about the Aboriginal's history and culture and their understanding of the environment and how things were done a very, very long time ago. I do that with sometimes teaching language sometimes teaching um, dance, uh, sometimes teaching people how to create the, art the artifacts that we have here, teaching people hunting methods and catching on fish methods and all these kind of bits and pieces. Um, so I guess to start off, Nina Mani, Nyakimiyo, Nanyai, Wariu Kari, Nyai Wongan Garna, Nyai Tikrandi Garna Yurta, Niko Yurganindi Nyai Wongan Garna, Nyin, yeah, well. So, pretty much what I just said there was me speaking in my traditional language, that being what we do call the Ghana language, but it's a particular dialect of that language as well, coming from my family clan, which is the Mala Wira Miu, or the Mala Wira Miana, meaning dry forest um, country people. Uh, everything that I just said was hello, girls and boys. My name is the second born Emu. That is my traditional uh, totem name. And then I just continued by saying, um, I'm speaking in Ghana while I sit on Ghana country. Can you understand me? Yes or no? Um, there are many other things that I'll teach along the way, but until then, keep an eye out for the next video and see you next time.